we are in the middle of a three day heat wave. Today it's like 95 degrees, so how about some cold beer? <laughs> you think? Think there's some ice cold suds in here? Oh, God damn. <laughs> there's something in there. I'll turn the microphone so you can hear it sloshing. I don't know if you can hear that or not. Oh! But uh, I suspect it's not going to be all that refreshing. Anyway, welcome to another day a very hot and humid day of trash picking. Do you think I should optimistically pop the uh, trunk? Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We really need to find more scrap metal because this stupid beer keg is rolling around in the trunk. Just driving me crazy. So let's put these behind it. Maybe wedge them in there a little bit. That's not gonna hold it too well, but it'll hold it. Now let's see. Wow. Generator. See, this is kind of an interesting thing here. It's a clear mannequin. Last time I brought home a mannequin, I really couldn't sell it. I don't know though, have you ever seen a translucent mannequin? I think we should take it. Of course, today's the day that I got my buckets in the back. And let's see. Oh, am I a perv? We pulled the dude's pants down while we were out trash picking. I don't know, we kind of did, right? Ugh. the least fun I've ever had on dressing a woman, by the way. Ugh. Okay. 
All right, I'm gonna do the rest of those off camera, but look at this thing. Ow, 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 ow. Woo. <laughs> All right, here's, here's what we'll do. That sun that's shining in that mirror is like burning my face off. Look how long that copper pipe is though. Anyway, looks like there's a couple more mannequins. We need the shorts again. Because of this big thing. Stepping on these people's grass. I'm not even kidding. This metal is so hot. Sitting out in 95 degree sun. Ow, 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 ow. Ugh. All right, I'll, I'll load the, the rest of the dummies and catch back up with you later. I'm not sure who's the dummy. Oh, <laughs> maybe it's me. Anyway, it's wicked hot today, and I have a suspicion that I might be like the only guy who even comes out. And if I am, I might have to go home early. Ugh. Anywho, ew. Apparently my claim to fame is that I always take the little brass fittings out of these things. Somebody beat me to it today. Really? There we go. Welcome to our favorite place to go picking, which is the middle of nowhere. And look what we found. What is it? Looks like a jackhammer or something. Ugh. But I guess I gotta get out of the out of the way because uh, even though we're in the middle of nowhere there's always a car going somewhere like that lady over there we're actually further into the bowels of the middle of nowhere now let's open the trunk I really should reorganize the trunk but I'm not going to do it here. I might get eaten by a bear. All right, what do we got? A bucket of springs. 
I don't think we need that. Maybe we'll take that. And of course we take brake rotors. Always. Ugh. See, what I need to do is get that into the back there. And that way I can put everything else in the front. Although technically, yeah, right. Technically, I guess that's the front. When I say the front, I'm talking about here. So I want to be able to put these here, but first I have to put that there. And I'm not going to do that here. Want to take a more careful look at this thing? Let's check it out. Wow, I can't go anywhere without my car making a ton of noise, huh? I thought we were going to get away from the muffler. I guess not. All right. Kango. This tool can go anywhere that you put it. Kango Type 900. Caution. For safe operation instruction manual, this hammer is double insulated. It's a hammer. All right. Norm Abram, eat your heart out. No, it's not that kind of hammer. We're still in the middle of nowhere. But the middle of nowhere is where you can find Nice bikes! Oh my god, look at this thing. It's this adorable little BMX bike. Let's see what we got there. Free agent. I used to ride a free agent. That's why my username is Newberg BMX. Because uh, I used to ride BMX, believe it or not. We don't want you to see their uh, address there. Wow. All right, do we really want a bunch of little Barbie dolls? Nah, probably not. This is actually a pretty, uh, pretty nice bike. It's got a tri-moly frame, which is like, these three tubes are chromoly and these ones are probably mild steel or high tensile. So it's like triangle of chromoly. They used to call it tri-moly. Pretty nice uh, rims. Weinman. 
I'm not sure about the one piece cranks, but it is a little kid's bike. Yeah, it might need a tube and a rim strip, but we'll probably find one of those later tonight. Yeah, cool little bike. I'll get it buckled up and then we'll uh, get back in the car with all the dummies. Wow. Why is this so difficult? What do you think that is? Any good art? In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful, I seek refuge with the Lord and cherisher of mankind, the king or ruler of mankind, the god or judge of mankind, from the mischief of the whisper of evil who withdraws after his whisper, the same who whispers in the hearts of mankind, among jinns and among men. Here's one called Tiger Country. Guess we could put that back where it goes over here. Anyway, I'm not too impressed by the art selection. Check out the foam on this pad though. It's like totally falling apart at the seams. Look at it from this side. You ever see that on a bicycle safety pad before? I haven't. I'm not even joking. I haven't stopped at a pile in like four hours. It's dusk now. It's a lot cooler. I stopped and took a nap. Today has not been a very uh, productive day. All right, maybe we'll take this box of springs. It's pretty heavy. And this IKEA picture frame. Spool of wire. I don't think we need the pressure washer. Or the colander. Or the random parts from some motorcycle frame. Or the folding chairs. Tempted to take this steel though. Steel is pretty high right now, but I don't think that would fit in the car. All right, folks, I guess that's gonna do it for today. That's what happens when it's like 98 degrees outside and muggy too. See, the fans came on. Anyway, we did get this uh, entire carload full of translucent dummies and this bike. That was all hours ago, though. And I guess that's about it for us today. So until next time.
appreciate you keeping me company and uh, thanks for watching